temps here across the area. So that cold front is doing its job. Temperatures are going to drop tonight and really not rebound too much tomorrow in the wake of that front. So we're seeing lots of low to mid 60s here across the area. 68 degrees. This is from our friend Gary in Annapolis. Love the new photo, Gary. Let's take a look at some of our pictures here. So George, always on the flower game. So we love to see these. And you're saying late bloomers, hydrangea 2019. You know, some of us are late bloomers. That's okay. And this picture from Audrey. Uh, and then we love to see these flower pictures coming in. So keep them coming and whatever outdoor activities you're doing for spring. Okay, here's what we're tracking on the radar. So we do have a small craft advisory in effect. Remember, as this cold front pushed through, we have some very strong winds in the wake of that front, and that's going to kick things up on the bay. That's the small craft advisory through tomorrow evening. The storm reports. So you'll notice here, these are the wind reports, and then we also have many hail reports as well. So far, I think the largest hail reported would be egg sized hail. That's two inches, and that would be for Montgomery County. So that was a strong storm that moved through. We hit 87 degrees. Uh, just after 1.30 this afternoon. No 80s for us tomorrow. 70s only. 67 right now at BWI, 68 Westminster, mid-60s there in Hagerstown. Let's time out what we can expect over the next couple of days. So as we move into Monday, here we are, 7 a.m. At that point, the cold front well off to the east. Nothing at all popping up here to show you on Monday. Let's take a look at Tuesday, 7 a.m. Again, Nothing at all here. You can see just some light rain that moves in early Wednesday morning. Remember, when I don't have anything to show you here on the future cast, that just means we're looking at quiet and calm weather, and that really is the case for Monday and Tuesday. Not so much as we move into Wednesday and Thursday. We have chances for storms. So just enjoy Monday and Tuesday while they're here. But tonight, actually dropping down into the 50s. We haven't seen those temperatures in a while. And then tomorrow, 74, that is the high. We stay in the 70s as we look at Tuesday there, headed for a high of 78. And then we make our way back into the 80s. And the heat returns, the humidity, and, of course, the chances for storms as well.